Welcome back to Psalm 18. This is a long one, so buckle up. Here we go. I love you, O Lord, my strength. The Lord is my rock, my fortress, and my deliverer. My God is my rock in whom I take refuge. He is my shield and the horn of my salvation, my stronghold. I call to the Lord who is worthy of praise, and I am saved from my enemies. The cords of death entangle me. The torrents of destruction overwhelm me. The cords of the grave coiled around me. The snares of death confronted me. In my distress, I called to the Lord. I cried to my God for help. From his temple, he heard my voice. My cry came before him into his ears. I love that thought. The earth trembled and quaked, and the foundations of the mountain shook. They trembled because he was angry. Smoke rose from his nostrils. Consuming fire came from his mouth. Burning coals blazed out of it. He parted the heavens and came down. Dark clouds were under his feet. He mounted the cherubim and flew. He soared on the wings of the wind. He made darkness his covering. His canopy around him, the dark rain clouds of the sky. Out of the brightness of his presence, clouds advanced with hailstones and bolts of lightning. The Lord thundered from heaven. The voice of the Most High resounded. He shot his arrows and scattered the enemies. Great bolts of lightning and routed them. The valleys of the sea were exposed and the foundations of the earth laid bare. At your rebuke, O Lord, at the blast of your breath from your nostrils. He reached down from on high and took hold of me. He drew me out of the deep waters. He rescued me from my powerful enemy, from my foes who were too strong for me. They confronted me in the day of my disaster, but the Lord was my support. He brought me out into a spacious place. He rescued me because he delighted in me. The Lord has dealt with me according to my righteousness, according to the cleanness of my hands. He has rewarded me. For I have kept the ways of the Lord. I have not done evil by turning from God. All his laws were before me. I have not turned away from his decrees. I have been blameless before him and have kept myself from sin. The Lord has rewarded me according to my righteousness, according to the cleanness of my hands in his sight. To the faithful you show yourself faithful. To the blameless you show yourself blameless. To the pure you show yourself pure. But to the crooked you show yourself shrewd. You save the humble but bring low those whose eyes are haughty. You, O Lord, keep my lamp burning. My God turns my darkness into light. With your help, I can advance against a troop, and with my God, I can scale a wall. As for God, his way is perfect. The word of the Lord is flawless. He is a shield for all who take refuge in him. For who is God besides the Lord? We have 20 more verses to go. Here we go. And who is the rock except our God? It is God who arms me with strength and makes my way perfect. He makes my feet like the feet of the deer. He enables me to stand on the heights. He trains my hands for battle. My arms can bend a bow of bronze. You give me your shield of victory. Your right hand sustains me. You stoop down to make me great. You broaden the path beneath me so that my ankles do not turn. I pursued my enemies and overtook them. I did not turn back till they were destroyed. I crushed them so they could not rise. They fell beneath my feet. You armed me with strength for battle, and you made my adversaries bow at my feet. You made my enemies turn their backs in flight, and I destroyed my foes. They cried for help, but there was no one to save them. To the Lord, but he did not answer them. I beat them as fine dust, borne on the wind. I poured them out like mud in the streets. You have delivered me from the attacks of the people. You have made me the head of the nations. People I did not know are subject to me. As soon as they hear me, they obey me. Foreigners cringe before me. They all lose heart. They come trembling with their strongholds. I love 46. The Lord lives. Praise be to my rock. Exalted be God my Savior. He is the God who avenges me, who subdues nations under me, who saves me from my enemies. You exalted me above my foes. From violent men you rescued me. Therefore I will praise you among the nations, O Lord. I will sing praises to your name. He gives his king great victories. He shows unfailing kindness to his anointed, to David and his descendants forever. Whew, that was a lot. Psalm 18 is very long, but a couple verses real quick to go back to. On verse 29, with your help I can advance against a troop, and with my God I can scale a wall. And I have down here, well back in 2019 I wrote this, but I would, back in 1986 I was on uh, Teen Missions International on a mission trip. We had to go to Florida for boot camp for two weeks before we went to Kenya, Africa. And so we had to learn how to do this obstacle course together as a team. And so here we are 
scaling this wall. I got a little picture there, I love it. So I could literally scale a wall with God's help. And then I also love 33. He makes my feet like the feet of the deer. He enables me to stand on the heights. And that's just a really important verse to me because when I do have hard times, I just remember a deer, right, can just scamper on up so easily and go scale those heights, be up high and look down and see everything. And that's what God's gonna do for me. When I'm having a hard time, he's gonna give me the energy and strength that I can just scamper on up like a deer, up to the heights and just look down and just kind of see the bigger picture. So I love those verses. I love Psalm 18. I hope you enjoyed this and we'll see you back here tomorrow. And I would like to answer any question you may have about faith in Jesus. Just email me through my website, nancyjoytoyou.com. 